We employ a special situation style, which means that we tend to hedge most of our market risk and have positions on both the long and short side where we think that the idiosyncratic risks that we're taking are likely to profit both long and short. How does the world feel to you right now? I mean, the, the markets in general, how do they look to you? They look fully valued, but I don't think that we can accurately call whether we're at a market top or whether there's a lot more to go. You have a couple of interesting picks that I want to get to in the time that we have. I want to go with your short pick first. Sure. And that is worldwide wrestling uh, entertainment, WWE. Why short? So the company has roughly a billion dollar market cap, and they've launched an over the top network. And pretty much all of their profitability going forward is dependent on the OTT network. And right now, based on the number of subscribers that they have, they'll earn nothing at a corporate level. And they need to double the number of subscribers just to justify their current valuation. And we think that that's never going to happen. So it's a subscriber-based network, and the subs were disappointing. Exactly. Houston, we have a problem. Exactly. So they launched at, in April at WrestleMania, and at the time they launched with 670,000 subs. But by the end of the second quarter, they only managed to add an additional 30,000 subs. And as we've done scuttlebutt-based research into how people are reacting to the network, we think that people are really unhappy and that the number of additions is going to prove to be very disappointing. Why don't you make the long case then for Fortress Investment Group? Um, I mean, Investment Group underscores it really because... They do everything. Sure. Um, so what's nice about Fortress is the margin of safety that we think that there is in the stock. It trades around six and a half dollars a share, and there's roughly four dollars a share of cash investments and accrued incentive income, which means that for the business, you only pay two and a half dollars. And when we look at the business, we can identify parts of Fortress that are extremely healthy and, in fact, thriving, parts like the Castles business or the credit business. And we think that those two parts alone can earn 50 cents a year. So for the health healthy parts of Fortress, we're paying only five times earnings when you add in the cash. And then for the parts of Fortress that are struggling, like the liquid hedge funds or the traditional private equity business, that's like a free option to the upside for us.